Hey everybody, Tokusa here, and welcome back to another My Hero Ultra Impact video! So we finally get our first look at the Step Up banner, and it is glorious. It took them three freaking years to implement this, but it is what we have needed. Something to really incentivize summoning, right? And this comes with a lot of value. So, uh, yeah, without further ado, just in case you've missed it, I'm gonna recap everything that you can get. Uh, it's got tremendous value, and I recommend summoning only on this banner, and never to touch this banner unless a you go through all six laps or b you have silver tickets because you you can only use silver tickets on this banner but keep in mind this does not have 1.5 rates in it anywhere so this is definitely not the banner you want to touch uh but yeah step one 250 gems for 10 units already a win uh and five you are uh limit break fragments for memories so off the bat off the rip half multi off and five you are fragments that is tremendous value Step two is a regular price multi, but 1.5 rates. So uh, your typical Impact Fest banner. And then 30 stars on top of that. So that's a nice little like icing on the cake for that multi. The third one, back to 0.7 rates, but you are guaranteed a UR memory guaranteed, which can be one of the Impact Fest memories. That is tremendous value. And 10 fragments. Like that's bizarre, right? Uh, step four, half off again uh 0.7 rates again but you're getting 50 shards for midoriya so you can already awaken them if you pick them up within the four first four steps you can just get them up to board six assuming you have the materials for the other boards tremendous value and then step five being the best of the best of course uh 1.5 rates you got your impact fest rates you are guaranteed a ur character which can be one of the impact fest units and you are getting 50 shards for Bakugo. ridiculous value out of these banners and you can do this six times right I know it says the, ca uh, the lap count is five, but zero is counting as one here. So six times, which lets you literally get a pity for Midoriya and Bakugo. So 12,000 gems to get two characters guaranteed. Are you kidding me? That is ridiculous value. You're also going to have uh, 90 uh, UR fragments. So you're going to get four memory uh, dupes and almost half or halfway to a fifth one. So if you pull one of the memories within your six rotations, you can basically max one of those memories, right? So you get Bakugo's memory and Bakugo. You max that memory up. Uh, you get another copy from Bakugo just from going all the way to Pity. It's just it's insane. It's, it's such good value. So anyways, we're going to do a full rotation here. Uh, I'm not going to go any further than that. Uh, I may have plans in the future. Of course, well, I'll definitely have summoning plans in the future for this. But just for the initial, uh, you know, first look at the banner, I will do one rotation and see how it goes. Also, uh, as I hop into this... Uh, summon here you can see that i have a layout going on right now uh i used to do everything on pc i had an emulator uh blue stacks when i updated the game for uh you know just for it on the computer the game just crashes immediately on blue stacks as soon as i opened it up the, the game crashed so I had to switch back to my phone which i was also worried about right because i know sparks uh it used to crash on s24 i just think any phone no fake up any phone that had the newest uh, processing like, chip in it, the game just would not run on it for the longest time. So it's the whole reason I switched to PC, just desperately trying to find an emulator that worked. And then that crashed, but now it works on my phone. Hopefully, knock on wood, but yeah. So that's why if you're seeing the layout, uh, shout out to DRC3, kind of just gave me his old one and I just kind of tweaked it to fit my own style. N nothing special here, uh, but yeah. Kind of clean. I still got to adjust the little things. You can see on the bottom, it's not fully fit in there. And if you didn't notice that now, I'd probably just ruin the whole video for you because you're going to see that Tokus has slightly cut off. But I will fix that up in the future. Uh, just quick fix. And yeah, hopefully y'all like it. Simple Tokuyami color, so figured it was pretty fitting. Uh, but yeah, next multi. So we did get five fragments there, which is beautiful. I love that now it tells me that I'm going to get 30 stars. I am getting 1.5 rates, so memories and the two characters now boosted rate. This is beautiful. This is what it should have been for so long. Every Impact Fest banner should have had these rates. Should have had, like, an incentive to summon on them. So it is so nice seeing this in the game. All right, give me something, though. Give me something beautiful. Like I said, I'm only doing one rotation for this video. Nothing more. Uh, Sparks? It hurts. It hurts a little bit. But the next summon... Damn. The next summon, no matter what, is going to have UR memory. So, I can't lose. I can't lose. But, I mean, 1.5 rates didn't treat me too well here. But it is what it is. 
Uh, yeah, definitely let me know how your summons are going for this. Uh, this is very cool. It's, it's it's just more fun to summon when there's like more rewards on the line, right? It's just cool. I'm enjoying it so far. That being said, if I don't get the characters, the step up should never come back. Let's just say that. I better get one of these damn characters. Uh, okay. Um, okay, so this is guaranteed UR memory. It's very nice. 10 UR fragments, right? Uh, but 0 0.7 rates. So regular general pool rates but guaranteed memory. So hopefully we can grab one of those impact fest memories. That would be huge. I didn't look at the actual rates, but I'm going to assume, uh, even though you're guaranteed the UR memory, uh, it's probably boosted rates for them as well. Like you're more, I wouldn't say more likely to get them, but in terms of percentage, it's probably higher than the general pool memories, but hopefully we can grab one of those. That would be beautiful. Preferably, I don't care. Probably Midoriya's because I can use it on multiple units. Oh, we're getting two UR. Oh, is that? I, th I figured it would be the 10th slot where you get the UR memory. So I figure, I think we're going to get two. I don't think they would just throw it in the middle there. So girl talk. Okay, cool. Onslaught. Oh, we're going to get three UR memories? What is going on? I'm pretty sure we're going to get three UR memories here. I mean, I would much prefer one of the impact us memories, though. But, uh, but uh, that's sick. I'm very happy about that. Let me see if my theory is right here. Okay, it is the 10th slot. So you do... I got three R memories in that summon. Are y'all kidding me? Uh, none of what I wanted. But yeah, I was going to say, that one's new. I didn't recognize that one. Uh, none of the Impact Fests, but that's crazy. What an insane summon there. Okay, step four. 0 0.7 rates here. We got uh, Midoriya here. Uh, 50 shards no matter what. So if we could pick up Midoriya in this summon, that would be beautiful. If we don't, it is what it is. Uh, but yeah, what I was saying and what I was hoping for in that last summon. All right, we got outfit changes a little bit. It could fake out. Uh, Midoriya's memory would be better for me because Tokuyami could use it. And then definitely Lady Nagant could use it on my team, right? So it could be really good, especially against this new All Might, which I'm pretty sure you're going to need Piercing Shot and uh, other things. Purple, of course, is going to be very powerful too. Just things that Midoriya has because I'm assuming fake out. Oh, we got a fake out. Give me Deku, please. Just because I get the 50 shards here. Please. Oh, that would be clutch. If I get one of the characters, I'll, I'll stay up and do a showcase. Y'all hear me, game? Please be one of the characters. Don't do me dirty. Give me Deku. Just gotta get his shards, too. Come on. Come on now. All right. These are all crap memories. Give me the character. <laughs> oh, I thought that was a memory. I thought that was your memory. Bro, it's the last one. Oh, Red Hawks! No, oh, come on, bro! Y'all gotta give me a character. None of, not one of the new ones. Oh, they literally tease that right at the end, too. That's painful. But 50 shards to Midoriya, right? So if I want to suffer and go all the way to Pity and go all the way six rotations, I, I, I get the character for free. Okay, let me reiterate free. Uh, painful debt, but I would get the character no matter what. Okay. Final multi, not going any further than this, uh, but so far, even though we didn't get any of the featured stuff, we got three UR memories, Red Hawks, and then of course all the incentives that you get for doing these summons, so hopefully final multi luck will come alive here. It would be beautiful, so let's hope here. Uh, but yeah, come on, give me some outfits. Uh, they could fake out like the other one, but not loving it so far. I'm going to hope the 1.5 rates can keep us alive here with a fake out. Give me sparks. Give me something. Give me some hope here. Anything? Please? Uh, step ups need to go, man. They're trash. No better. Oh, step ups are great. Steps are lovely. I hope they keep bringing them back every single impact fest. Do not give me red hawks. Give me something new, please. End with the bang on the final multi. I saw Hawks, I almost had a heart attack. Don't, don't get me wrong, Hawks is cool. You know, Tokuyami's mentor. But, like, something new. God damn, I thought it was right there. Whew, okay. Listen, listen. Game. One of the new characters right here, right now. Oh, Vigilante deck. I bro. <laughs> this is like do 12. Yeah, oh. Woo. Woo. Come on. WR, 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 WR. That's an SR. That's probably it. Oh, just, just, oh. 
I'm sick. I'm sick. I'm deleting this game. Never want to play it again. Y'all gonna give me that Midoriya. I don't even think he was useful when the game dropped. I'm sick to my stomach. That is not how y'all do me. <laughs> Come on, man. Okay, well, I did get s six URs in this video. Uh, hopefully y'all get the featured units and not what I got. Um, Vigilante Deku would be great if I didn't have him maxed out. I don't even want to look at that MND Deku. Red Hawks, I'm pretty sure I have all the dupes for him too. But I did get one new memory out of this, but... Anyways, remember, all those bonuses I said at the beginning, I'm also going to get along with those summons that I just did. Of course, I would have loved to get one of the new units or memories. I had multiple ch chances, but it is what it is. I think the game crashed on me. It's a good time to end it anyways. So best of luck if you are summoning on this. I hope y'all get better luck than what I did. Uh, I mean, granted, I know I got six URs, which I should be grateful for, but they ain't none of the featureds. I would have preferred a featured, man. So... Hopefully you do get one that you're chasing, or just something featured at least, so you know, see, you know, you know, good anniversary start for y'all. So, anyways, like and subscribe if you enjoyed the content. I am trying to get to a thousand subscribers, so if you could do that for me, that would be great. My game crashed, I'm just not gonna worry about it. So, uh, thank y'all for watching. Best of luck if you do summon, and until the next one, Tokus out.